Hey guys, Luke here, and welcome back to Season 3, Episode 16 of my New Zealand Warriors Rugby League 2 uh, career mode playthrough. In this game, we're going to be playing a preliminary final, so basically a semi-final. I don't really know why they call it that, but yeah, a semi-final, a qualifying final for the grand final. And uh, we're taking on the West Tigers, who are I'm not sure, didn't really catch what position they actually started at, but I think it might have been 6, possibly. And I think they defeated the Storm to get into this game. Um... Last episode, we ended up beating the Panthers pretty convincingly. Uh, they they also went through into this round as well. Um, that they had to play another game, obviously, because we beat them. But the week off, I think it came at a really good time. Uh, we were wrestling players at the end of last, uh, sorry, at the end of the season. But uh, just the week off, you know, really, really happy to have that. Um, in saying that, though, Tigers were one side that we had a lot of trouble with um, in the previous games. Although we did win, obviously, because the unbeaten streak is still there. Um, but yeah, you, you can see they're definitely trouble us a little bit. 18 minutes in, the first real highlights come from them, like up the wing. Same sort of uh, things that happened last time. They just get out to the wingers like Utah and that sort of stuff. And, you know, we had a lot of trouble there. Uh, in saying that, though, you can tell by the length of the episode that it's not exactly, you know, the most exciting episode, I'd have to say, in terms of highlights and that sort of stuff. Although, there are a few every now and then. We've got Ben Madalino here, just running it up. Uh, but quick play of the ball, but it's exactly what we needed. Go to Bill Tupo here, down the wing here, and that's a great tackle by Moulton. And that's not where the highlight's going to end here. Going to get it to Sean Johnson, puts a little grubber for himself, and there's the first try of the game. 29 minutes in, it took a little while. Um, not too many highlights for us, I'd have to say. Um, pretty even, just a lot of defence, more defensive game at this stage. Uh, and great defence from us, I'd have to say, as well as them. But puts a little grubber in, it comes off Hawkinson, uh, the duplicate Hawkinson, I believe. And... Um, Johnson just picks it up, puts it down, too easy, and then to rub insult into injury, goes and slots his own conversion, so 6-0 it is, and uh, not too much longer later, Mossy Masoy gets the ball here, and it's a really, really dumb offload, and then Keith Galloway gets an offload to Larry, thankfully we bring him down there, then they're going to go and uh, put up a bomb here, but number 15, I think it was Rapira or someone, ends up just grabbing the ball, and I uh, take it at half time, 6-0 up. And I was pretty happy at this stage, yeah, with the performance. Um, obviously, not the most exciting game, but I'm not really um, in the final series to excite teams. That was for the regular season. In these games, we just want to win at all costs. You can see there, nearly an intercept, nearly Hawkinson picking up a pass, but Mateo ends up with the ball. Kevin Locke, just sort of momentum kill there for Rapira. Um, and then we throw an intercept here, Robbie Farah. He was away, uh, but not quite off to the races, as he ended up getting in there. A great pass here. It was why Penny. I don't know who Penny is. Probably like sort of like a region sort of player. Um, but I think it was uh, Galloway or Fulton or someone end up with the ball. Then they end up putting up a bomb here. And Kevin Locke goes back to his fullback days and also his wing days and just takes that quite easily. Um, nice little run there by Simon Mentoring just to get us a bit out of trouble there. And uh, you know you can see I'm really uh, scraping the barrel for um, decent highlights. But basically six nil. I'm willing to take the victory. Like I said many times. Josh Hoffman here. Runs it back very, very nicely. Mateo just kills it right there. Uh, kills the player, I should say. What, that's what I meant by that. Um, thankfully, Penny, uh, and it's not necessarily his fault, more of a, the hooker. I don't know if it was Farrell or who it was, but yeah, a terrible pass, and then we just throw him over the sideline. Nilsson come up with the big play here. Now, at this stage, 77 minutes in, just sort of easing it. You think, you know, just go for the field goal. Hell no. Jen Jesse Santa Lefeo, he's going to seal the game. It's game over. We're going to the grand final. Uh, season 3, that's 3 grand finals Hopefully 3 wins coming up, you'd like to think Sending a fire just hits a hole Hawkinson couldn't get him and then Molson just gets burned as well And you know, I'd have to say Tigers put up a valiant effort Probably one of the hardest games I've had to play this season It hasn't been that many hard games But Tigers are definitely one of the hardest sides Just a well-rounded team um, But yeah, as you can see, celebrating the win Definitely got the win, 12 no it was We weren't going to be missing that conversion from in front. And Sean Johnson picks up man of the match. Uh, so I think Simon Mentoring had a good game. A lot of players had a great game. But you can see there, uh, Panthers end up getting beat by the Cowboys. So in the grand final, we'll be taking on the North Queensland Cowboys. Jonathan Thurston, as you can expect, man of the match in that game. And you know, it's going to be a great battle for us. Hopefully you stick around and tune in for the next episode. And uh, yeah, make sure you leave a like for this episode as well. Subscribe to my channel if you want to follow me on Twitter at MrLukeMyT is my Twitter handle. I've got a Facebook page in the description below, which is also linked to my Twitter page if you just prefer to use Facebook. And um, yeah, make sure you like and subscribe. Bye, guys.